This morning, a lot of anxious parents of small children may be breathing a sigh of relief. An FDA panel voted Wednesday to recommend both the Moderna and Pfizer vaccines for little kids. That's the only group still ineligible for the shot. Moderna's shot is for kids ages six months to five years. Pfizer's for kids up to four years old. There are still a few more rounds of review, and then the CDC director has to sign off. But that should all happen by Tuesday, and we could start seeing shots in arms by the middle of the week. In most places, that is. But not likely Florida. That is the only state that has not put in an order with the federal government for vaccines for kids under five. NBC Shannon Pettypiece joins me now with more on this. So, Shannon, what reason has the Florida Department of Health given for not ordering any vaccines? Well, they're saying that they're not recommending vaccines for children under five. And that's despite the recommendations you mentioned this week from this panel of FDA advisors and then uh, an anticipated recommendation coming from the CDC. Regardless of that, they say that they, the state health department and the governor who made these comments a few moments ago said that they don't believe the potential risks outweigh the benefit. Uh, the governor said that there's, his, in his words, practically zero risk in this age group, even though the FDA pointed out there's more than 400 kids in this age group who've died from COVID, uh, and that they don't want to be involved in the federal efforts to get this vaccine to the youngest kids. Now, DeSantis said parents can still get the vaccine, but those vaccines will have to be ordered directly from a doctor or a hospital. The state is not going to be involved in distributing them, which has been the case in every state and in the past in Florida, where the federal government, who is the main buyer of vaccines, the only buyer of vaccines in the U.S., gets the vaccines and they allocate them out to the states. And then the states are the ones who decide what pediatricians, offices and hospitals and who should get so many. Florida is basically saying they are not participating in that process at all. They will not be helping doctors' offices and states get these vaccines. If they want those, they're going to have to order them directly because the state has taken the position that they don't believe these youngest children should get the vaccine.